and welcome back to the channel. Um, today, as you can see by the title, we're going to change out these LEDs for my 2016 SDI. Um, we're just going to change out these uh, the fog lights right here. I did that halogen yellow. And uh, we're going to change out these DRLs. That's what we're changing on today. I'm just going to do a quick install and um, unboxing them for uh, the box. And uh, yeah, this should be quick and easy. We shouldn't need any tools. And uh, we should just have to like pull back this fender liner and we should be fine and go through the top here to get to the, to the DRL All right there. I'm going to change them out with LEDs. So uh, yeah. So real quick guys, these are boxes. I'm going to do a quick unboxing. This one, it looks like these are the 9005, so these will be the DRLs slash high beams right here by Oxbeam. Uh, and these are the S2s, the FS2, I think they're called right there. And they are 9005. And uh, the other one that I'm gonna unbox it's, uh, should be the, the fog lights which um, I know for the base model is H16 and for the, you know, for the model with the turning fog lights or whatever, they're H11s. I got the H11s. I thought these will fit. Everybody says they fit, you know? So we're gonna give it a shot. I'll let you know, you know if it doesn't fit, I'll order the other ones and uh, return these right here. So they're the H11s for the fog lights. Ox being, I think they're 6,000 K each one. They're 6,000 K for uh, the color temperature. And they are 8,000 lumens. So that means 4,000 and 4,000 each bulb or whatever. So they should be that light, nice little pure white color. So these are the, these right here are the DRLs. This is what it comes with. Is what it come with the DRL upstream instruction blah 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 we don't need that a couple of ox feet stickers and uh, these are the balls themselves um, the thing that I like about these um, it's the that it doesn't bring like ballast or something like those big bricks or whatever it's just a fan plug and play that's it no ballast at all so that's freaking awesome that's the fan 9005 and nothing else comes in the box. I'm trying to do this real quick guys so you guys won't get bored. But uh, let's do the what do you call it? The fog lights. Ox beam H11s. Hopefully they fit too. <laughs> this is just this gonna suck if it doesn't fit. Wait two more days for another one, but whatever. Alright, let me put this down. Guys, same thing. Instructions, stickers, more stickers, and these are the DRLs, which are H 11s like I said. And uh, they're the same thing. Six thousand K, eight thousand lumens, four thousand each bulb, and uh, they have the LEDs there. I think it's one big LED. Yep. And the fan, no ballast. You know, like brick or whatever. Sometimes it starts hanging and it's a fucking pain in the ass, period. So, yeah, guys. Let's see. So, let's get to this distance. Oh, real quick. It should be quick and easy. I'm gonna do the fog lights first. They seem like they'll be the easiest. And that will replace this yellow. Alright, okay, guys. So, it should be quick and easy um, to go to that fog light. You should be able to um, pull this line out right here. If you want, you can take off the tab. Some people say, oh, and there's another tab down here, actually. Yeah. So I'm just gonna take off a few tabs. 
and uh, once you get this started, we'll be right back. For the fog light. Looks like that's the fog light. Yes, yeah, it's H16. Shit. That looks like it'll be a pain in the ass. Making my job harder for myself, but you could just take out that tab too. And uh, yeah, you'll, uh, you'll be able to get under there. All right, I'll be right back, guys. All right, guys, so from the bottom, it's so much easier. Just one clip and uh, stick your hand in there and just uh, pull out the bolt. That's pretty much it. So I'm gonna sort of do a quick comparison. So these are the factory halogen bulbs. Obviously they say H16, mine's uh, H11. Um, I'll let you know if they fit, but they should. I've seen a couple of people do this. Um, here's a side by side comparison too. Turn off, maybe it's the wrong way. The positive and the negative. Yep, and that's what it was. So I uh, make sure you put them the right way. The positive and the negative, it's gotta be a certain orientation. If not, it won't turn on. Alright, I'm gonna install these and I'll show you the differences how they look like the halogen and the LED on one side. And the aux beam it's on this side here and the stock bulb is over there i'll show you oh yeah big difference i don't know if you guys can see it but uh yep you could tell right there it looks fucking awesome they're bright too it's sunny as hell outside and i, for and I forgot to mention guys all you need for this install is one of these um flathead screwdrivers just to uh, get the clips out or you could use these tools you know these uh, prying, prying tools or whatever they're called uh, you could use that that's all you need just uh, letting you guys know the first thing you want to do obviously it's just uh, pop the hood shut off the headlight uh, the fog lights there just gonna pop the hood and uh, I think it's the same thing I don't think you have to like take anything out or anything I think you would just stick your hand in there and get to the DRLs so let me put this back actually I don't need it right now I'm such a noob I'm gonna take out I'm gonna take out this one first so the DRL is uh oh, sorry I got the runny nose so they're right here i'm pretty sure this is the drl right here yep the drl is right there so you could just take that one right out and uh put in the the the, the and on this side the drl let me see yep awesome they're right here i don't know if you can see that right there so i don't have to take off any of this stuff i don't think anyway all right, let's get this started. You see, my running nose is cold out here. Really cold. All right, so we're gonna take out the DRLs, which is this one here, and replace it with the Oxstream LED. So we'll just twist to the left, lefty loosey, loosey, and uh, righty tidy, or whatever the hell you wanna say. Uh, let's see here. Which one it is? Anyway. So just slide it right under here. Should be using gloves actually. And just clip it out. That's it. So these are the same as my uh, my fog lights. So exactly the same fan pattern, no ballast or whatever that big brick that hangs out. I hate it. Same thing. It's a little fan. And put on a glove. Put these in. Yeah, you gotta get these. I think the the right way also, or if not, they won't light up. Let me uh, make sure this lights up. I'm just not tightening it. I guess. 
there. Uh, they're tight. Let me see something. I'm gonna try to put the the factory. Um, what do you call it? The factory O-ring, just to see if it tightens up, because it's tight. But there's a, li a little, little, little slight wiggle, and I don't like that. This uh, O-ring right here. See if it tightens up a little, and if it doesn't, then uh, I'll just leave it like that for now. Just uh, put the second O ring on the back, like that, like that, and it should tighten up a little. It still has a little bit of wiggle, even with the factory one. All right. So that O ring, the factory O ring, doesn't do anything for it. There you go guys, uh, Ton, this is what the final product look like. looks like, and I know it's really bright outside right now, I'll show you on night view, uh, how it looks like at night. Alright guys, here's the finished product, LED DRLs and fogs, so that's just the fogs. That's the DRLs right there. Damn, super bright. Wow. Looks freaking awesome, but it, they're super bright. Dude. I'm trying to back up. God damn. And the Honda Civic right next to it has HIDs. And those are the high beams right there. What are yours? Those are the high beams, but they're not HIDs, right? No, they're regular. Oh, yeah, oh, they're no. pretty bright, dude. Oh, yeah. That's the fog lights with my regular low beams. High beams, there you go. Those are high beams. It's just the LED fog lights right there with the uh, See what it looks like for incoming. so this is like with all my lights off um, these are my uh, DRLs right here that's just the daytime running lights and that's my uh, my stock low beams with uh, my LED fog lights so that's the fog lights right there with my stock low beams right there it's just the drls and so one more time it's completely off drls and with my uh led fog lights so that's it guys uh if you guys want to run your if you want to see like just your drls with uh you know with the c c light or whatever the boomerang light it's just like this it'll look like that so your high beams will stay on they will stay on just like that they don't have no like you, you they can't be lower like they'll stay on a full brightness all the time you know what i mean like they'll, even during the day but during the day it's not that bad it's uh it's not like blinding but at night eh, different story again 6k 8000 lumens for the fog lights and the drls and there are ox beam fs2s and yeah i think they're freaking awesome i love them and they're bright they're very bright as you can see and uh yeah I
so just throwing it out there for anyone um, if you're wondering if you could drive with just your DRL lights on are they bright enough you can see as you can see here yes they are bright enough it's your you know with these LEDs they're high beams and they stay on all the time since we have DRLs my DRLs are freaking uh, bright as hell 8,000 lumens so yeah you can drive with just them you don't even have to have your light uh, headlight uh, your low beams on or whatever but you're gonna be blinding people you gotta think about it like that so I don't think you guys want to do that anyway I just wanted to show you guys real quick all right let me take them off before somebody gets fucking pissed so yeah guys hope you enjoy and I'll see you on the next one thank you for watching guys yeah.